How's it going? So here we are in my final race of the season, Piemonte. And uh, what I thought I'd do is just show you guys a little bit or tell you a little bit about the team, the infrastructure we have here. You guys have seen inside the bus, all that other nonsense. But I'm going to talk to some staff here and uh, just show you how many days, and well, actually here, yeah, how many days on the road they are, um, how many kilometers they drive, and also to show you guys a little bit like how we disperse after races. Like, one guy goes to London, one guy goes here, one guy. So let's have a chat. Let's talk to the guys. It's all here. <laughs> we are with one of my favorite mechanics, <laughs> Maori. Maori yeah, bello. How are you? Good, good. How many days have you been on the road ah, this year? 190. 190, yeah? Yeah, almost 190, yeah. But it's Lots. also driving, you gotta go to lots of places. Off yeah. You go back to Italy. Yeah, but back you're to in Italy. Italy. So back you're lucky. in my country. So but I will stay here. Good, so he's going back to Italy after the race, he's staying home. Right. How many times have you been vacuuming the bus, bro? I don't know. <laughs> many. My friend, also, how many days a year have you been working? Uh, 115 days. 115? Yeah, for this moment. <laughs> so you have still some... Yeah. You're behind the others, eh? Where are you going after this, mate? Home. Where are you going after? Uh, Lombardi. Home. No, no, after home. Where? Poland? Yeah, Poland. Yeah. Back to Poland. He's got a cyclocross race that he organizes in Poland coming up. Kristaps. And Swania for our team. Through his main guy. How many days a year you've been working this year? Uh, after Lombardia will be 172. 172, and where do you live? Latvia. You go back to Latvia after yeah? I hopefully, yeah. Hopefully. Sometimes the race program, you know, changes a lot here, so guys don't know when they're going home. But he's going home probably after Latvia. So he's been working on. Andy, one of the least work staff in the team. You know? <laughs> one of the least, does the least amount of work, Come but on, important yeah. job, you know? Yeah. Andy, how many days have you been working this year? Uh, I'd say 90 on the road, but then days in Girona as well, as you know. So he works not only at the races, he works in Girona. Where do you go after this? You go back? I uh, go back Saturday night after Lombardia. To Girona. Back to Girona, yeah. So he's going to Girona, I'm going to Girona. For sure I'm going back to Girona. Um, and let's see who else we can get. But so far, little bit, ah! Oh! This is the most overworked guy in the team. Mikkel. How many days have you been working this year, mate? How many days 100, on the road? 115 on the road, probably. Yeah. And then most of it at home. And he's our media, what do we give you? Media liaison? Media? Yeah, something like that. Put whatever, however you want to put it, really. Yeah. And where do you go back? I go back after, after Lombardia. Yeah, but where? Where? I go back to Denmark. Denmark. So as you can see, this team is so multinational. We're from all over the place here. So, Go in the bus. Let's see if Merrick's vacuumed the bus because I told him I don't come to the races if the bus isn't clean. Okay, so now we're on the bus. This is the playground. This is where the sanctuary of the team. Director Sportif. Claudio. Yeah. Good come on, some morale. Morale. Yeah, morale. Yeah, he's still working for you. Uh, he's working here, but uh, how many days have you been working this year? How many days on the road? I don't know. Many. No, a yeah. Lot. How many? 90, uh, 100. I think uh, when I finish the season, around uh, 180. 180 days away from his family, you know? 180 no. days. I just want to tell you guys how the sport is so demanding. What you see on TV and everyone happy, smiley, the sacrifices everyone in the team makes to make this machine work. Yeah? And then you go back home. You're in Italy already, so you're home. Yeah, yeah. So I'm, you're near, lucky. I'm near my home. You're lucky. Yeah. Okay, okay, okay. <laughs> Stagiaire for the team. He's going to be joining the, the big team next year. How many race days you've done? We need to go 27. 27! This guy is going to ride Veneto, I'm telling you. <laughs> he hasn't done enough races. He also lives in Italy. He's staying here. Corbin, you? How race many race days? days? I think uh, 55, around that. Month. 55. And nice maybe, calendar. but this is maybe the end, no? Lombardia is the end? Lombardia is the end on the road. And then you're going where? Then I go to Paris for the track worlds. Oof, it's still a long season. But, but then he's going where? Where's your home? New Zealand. New Zealand, yeah. Middle he's, of November. He's going to go to New Zealand. There you go, Alex. Injured a lot this year. Had a bit of bad luck. Yes. How many race days you've oh, done? I think even with a broken car wheel, I have 60 right now. 60? 60 race days. And where are you going back? You're going back to Andorra and then Canada? No. No Canada. No Not Canada. Christmas. Okay. So. so, Andorra. He's going to Andorra. Repton. One of the least race riders this year. You know, he's done no racing this year, hey? Yeah. 
How many race days you've done this year? Was the seventh, I think. And how many days away from home you reckon with training camp? Ah, oh, you didn't do training camps, no. eh? Did I not? No, no, I don't know how much. But uh, since July, I was not sm uh, not much home, so. Yeah. So, but you go back to where? Switzerland after? No, I go to Austria, but first I have to do some more Austria. races here. So. Ah, so the job's not finished, eh? No. For me, the job is finished in this race. So. That's why you're in such a good mood, isn't it? Exactly, and then finally our team doctor. Good morning. It. She has come from Israel. Where? Israel. Uh, Not with that many race days this year, eh? No. No? But she's coming for the final Italian block. And afterwards you wait to go. wrap it all up. Ah, exactly. And then you go back where? To, to Israel. Israel. Yeah. Exactly. So there you have it. A little bit of uh, insight into the team, where we're all dispersing to. As you can see, I'm super happy because it's the end of the season for me. Yeah, you should, you should, uh, and uh, you know what I plan to do? And I spoke about it at breakfast and we'll see if it goes through to Veneto. Is when they do that last team presentation of the year, I'm going to do a video. Instead of them, when they put the presentation up, I'm going to give a video of me just going, hey guys, on the beach, you know? And just like, good luck for your last race of the season. So we'll see if we can get that going. But, um, they want to, They don't appreciate it now. They like these jokes, you know, because they still got some racing. But a little bit inside, we had like how many six cars here? We got a, we got the, the trucks, the mechanics truck, the bus, and all of that needs to go someplace. So a lot of the, there's some stuff I didn't even get a chance to speak to, and they will be driving those cars to Spain, to the next race is Belgium, wherever. So I hope you got some insight, and uh, thanks for watching. Be lacquer. See you soon. Yeah, 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 yeah.